things with a poetic beauty and a nuanced understanding of light distinguished Butler within the broader Impressionist movement. The Giovanni period in his career showcased not only the landscapes bathed in the region's natural splendor, but also the intricacies of human existence against this idyllic backdrop. The Giovanni chapter in Theodore Earl Butler's artistic journey not only shaped his personal evolution as an artist, but also contributed to the broader narrative of American Impressionism. His canvases, marked by vibrant colors and a dynamic interpretation of light, stand as a testament to the enduring influence of Giovanni on his artistic vision. The legacy of Butler's time in Giovanni is woven into the very fabric of American Impressionism. The collaborative spirit, the exploration of nature's beauty, and the infusion of ordinary scenes with extraordinary grace continue to resonate in the canvases he left behind. Giovanni, with its gardens and artistic camaraderie, remains an integral part of the artistic tapestry that defines Theodore Earl Butler's lasting impact on the world of art. Personal and financial struggles cast a pall over the vibrant colors of Butler's canvases. However, undeterred by adversity, he continued to paint, leaving behind a legacy that stands as a testament to the enduring power and resilience of American Impressionism. As Theodore Earl Butler returned to the United States in 1913 after an extended period in Giovanni, a new chapter unfolded in his artistic journey. The years from 1913 to 1921 marked a period of transition and reconnection with his American roots, bringing forth a narrative that interwove the influences of European Impressionism with the evolving artistic landscape in his homeland. The period between 1913 and 1921 witnessed Butler navigating a dynamic artistic landscape in the United States. Having absorbed the tenets of Impressionism in Giovanni, he found himself at the intersection of European influences and the burgeoning American modernist movement. Butler's canvases during this time reflected a synthesis of styles, where the brushstrokes and color palette reminiscent of Impressionism converged with the evolving artistic experimentation of American modernism. His works echoed the influences of his European sojourn, while also embracing the burgeoning spirit of innovation in American art. Back on American soil, Butler re-established connections with the American art community. The vibrant energy of New York City, a burgeoning hub of artistic activity, provided a backdrop for new encounters and collaborations. The city's galleries and salons became spaces for artistic exchange, where Butler engaged with fellow artists, critics,